can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we will be taking a look at an altcoin, Dogecoin, shrank number eight on coin market cap. Dogecoin, the last one month, has traded for as high as $0.094. It has also traded for as low as $0.069. With a market cap of $10.1 billion, how low can Dogecoin go in the coming days and in the coming weeks? Dogecoin has gotten down by 19.1% in the last one month. A lot of all coins have seen double digit losses in the last one month. If Dogecoin continues dumping to Goblin Town, are we going to drop to new lows in this bear market? We'll be taking a look at the Dogecoin US dollar price chart on a three day time frame. We'll also be looking at Dogecoin's performance against Bitcoin, Dogecoin's performance against Ethereum, and we'll finally look at Dogecoin's market cap. The lowest we've seen it going in this bear market has been that $6.5 billion region. Are we heading back there in the coming days and the coming weeks? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, an investment in knowledge pays the best interest when it comes to investing. Nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. Do the necessary research, study, and analysis before making any investment decision. Let's get down to business. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. With the altcoin market dumping to Goblin Town in the last few weeks, with all coins looking as if they're standing on shaky legs, how low can we possibly go if we see Dogecoin dumping with the rest of the altcoin market? Double digit losses across the board in the last one month. If all coins continue dumping to Goblin Town, are we heading back to the yearly lows for Dogecoin? Dogecoin got to as low as a $0.05 level, but that was way back in June of 2022. We saw Dogecoin having a rally in 2022 October, where Dogecoin rallied up by around 200%. But since that rally, Dogecoin has been dumping to Goblin Town. Dogecoin has gotten to as low as a $0.064. Will Dogecoin drop to new lows in this bear market? Or are we already marked the bottom of Dogecoin in this bear market? From where we're currently trading, if Dogecoin is going back to the $0.051 region, Dogecoin should lose another 30 plus percent. We can easily dump to Goblin Town. All coins are known to be very volatile. A 30% dump to Goblin Town is very, very easy in a bear market. But right now, I believe we're closer to the bear market bottom than we are to the top. I'll not be shocked to see Dogecoin maybe even get to as low as a $0.043 level. It's a very strong support for Dogecoin at that region. A lot of bids will be placed at that level. Guys, at the portion of the time where we are, Guys, the region where we are in the bear market is where long-term investors are accumulating, getting ready for that wonderful bull run that might come in the future. Dogecoin has been dumping since the 4th of May of 2021. We have seen Dogecoin lose around 93% of its value. We have seen Dogecoin spend more than 742 days deep in Goblin Town. The previous bear market saw Dogecoin bottoming out around 800 days when the top came in. The top came in for Dogecoin on the 7th of January 2018. The bottom came in for Dogecoin around 799 days after the top was in. So if history repeats itself, if we're going to spend around 800 days in this bear market, the bottom for Dogecoin should come in the coming days and in the coming weeks because, guys, when Dogecoin will be hitting the 800 day mark in this bear market that will be around the 15th of july 2023 and a lot can happen from now until then we can easily see dogecoin dumping to the 0.043 dollar level but for us to get there dogecoin will have to dump by around 40 percent to gobbling town taking a look at some key details about dogecoin the last one year has seen it trade for as high as 0.15 dollars it has also traded for as low as 0.049 dollars it has a market cap of 10.1 billion dollars and shrank eight on coin market cap over 1.7 million people have dogecoin on their watch list on coin market cap we're deep in the crypto bear market if you want to get that 10x 20x maybe that 50x pump to the upside if you want to see those kind of huge gains that we've seen in the past bull market deep in this bear market is where you want to do majority of your accumulation deep in this bear market is where you get good value for money the bear market can be very long the bear market can be very brutal even after the bottom came in for dogecoin 
we only saw it have a 250 percent pump to the upside for the next 288 days so even though the bottom will come in eventually it doesn't mean we'll just start pumping to higher prices but when that pumps happen it can happen very very quickly from the 14th of december 2020 we saw dogecoin rallying up to higher prices in 144 days it went up by 24,000 percent a 246 x pump to the upside even though i don't think dogecoin will give us that kind of big gains in the future i still believe we can see 10x 20x maybe 30x to the upside for dogecoin dogecoin might be heading to above one dollar by the end of the next bull run that's what long-term investors are planning they are currently accumulating right now in this bear market if you want to join them getting ready for the next crypto bull run remember not to go all in too quickly all coins can easily dump to goblin town going all to going all in too quickly will rob you of the opportunity of accumulating when we see lower prices because you won't have any liquidity so you want the lacoste average into your positions and if you want to get some dogecoin for yourself you can get them on binance on coinbase exchange on qcoin on kraken on bitphoenix on bitrex and anywhere you get your popular altcoins you can get some dogecoin right there the altcoin season index is telling us we're heavily in bitcoin season capital has been concentrated in the bitcoin market for the last three months bitcoin has been holding us strong but history has showed us that over time accumulating all coins when when bitcoin season has always proven to be beneficial in the long term even though we can spend months on end in Bitcoin season, after Bitcoin season, we're going to be heading towards all coin season. And that's where we see all coins pumping to higher prices. But you have to be willing to accumulate when we're down in Goblin Town. You have to be willing to accumulate when the market is in extreme fear. If you take a look at Dogecoin's performance against Bitcoin, wonderful bull market. What happens in the bear market? Dumping to Goblin Town by 82%. And even though we had a rally in 2022 also, that rally took us up by around 250%. Right now, we're yet to have a rally to the upside in 2023, and we might easily be dumping to new lows in 2023. We can easily see Dogecoin lose around 30, maybe to 35% of its value against Bitcoin in the next few weeks. Against Ethereum, we're also almost dropping to new lows in this bear market. The last time we saw Dogecoin trading against Ethereum this low, was in April of 2021 when it was having that one final push to the downside. In the bear market, you see people flipping their altcoins back into Bitcoin, back into Ethereum. In the bear market, a lot of people are scared. And when people are scared, you see them running towards safety. And safety for us in the cryptocurrency market is Bitcoin and is Ethereum. If you take a look at Dogecoin's market cap sitting above the $10 billion region, the lowest we have seen Dogecoin's market cap go in this bear market was when it dropped to as low as $6.5 billion in June of 2022. My best guess is that we can see Dogecoin's market cap probably heading back to that $5 billion region. For us to head to that level, from where we are currently trading, Dogecoin's price will have to see a whooping 40 plus percent dumped Goblin Town. I know how volatile all coins can be, that dump can happen very, very quickly. But long-term investors will be accumulating right there. The previous bear market saw Dogecoin's market cap going down a total of 92%. This bear market, how low have we gone down? From the $98 billion region where Dogecoin's market cap got to on the 4th of May 2021, we have seen Dogecoin go down by around 93%. So maybe just maybe the bottom is in. Will it still be accumulating if we continue dumping to Goblin Town? Guys, drop your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notification to get notified anytime I drop a new video and anytime I go live. Remember guys, invest for the long haul. Don't get too greedy. Don't get too scared. See you guys in my next video. Remember, all I'm offering is the truth, nothing more.